Hi guys, so today I'm going to be unboxing my May Knit Crate, and this is the second month in a row that I have not actually opened it, and this thing was torturing me yesterday. I picked it up in the morning and it sat just in my house for the entire day while I was at work, and so I had to unbox it right away this morning because I, oh my gosh, there were several times yesterday that I wanted to open it, but I didn't, so yeah, we're going to open it quick. But before I get into that, I wanted to show you the project from last month, which is so cool. It's this hat, and I think the yarn was from Vocabulary Yarn, if I'm remembering correctly. I will leave that video linked below if you want to check that out. But it's this hat right here. Isn't this cool? I love the pop of orange with the blue. I would never put those colors together by myself, but I think it's so, so cool. And I just kind of would wear it like that on those colder winter or colder summer nights. Um, yeah, love that so much. But anyway, yeah, let's get into this box. So I've got my scissors, and does it seem like everybody has these scissors? They're just from Target, and they've got the gold handles on them. But anyway, I digress. So let's get this open. Okay, so let's take a look. So this is May's Knit Crate. And let's see, at night the rainforest comes alive. Dive deep into the exotic, vivid excitement of the night jungle with this month's Knit Crate shipments. An array of deep tones wake up our mysterious color palette. Think lush greens, vivid violets, and peacock blues. We let the iridescent moonlight guide us deep into the wild jungle with this dynamic combination of Tani's Viber Arts, Organic Merino, and our May theme. Create your choice of the honeycomb cap or sawtooth shawlette. Ooh, I like that idea. Um, so then it's got all the information about what's inside. Ooh, this is pretty. So starting out with the yarn, it is that Tawny's Fiber Arts. I think that's how you say it. I'm not sure. Um, and this is in the color Iris. Oh, isn't that pretty? I think it does have all of the colors that it was talking about. It's got the blues and the purples and just really, really pretty. It kind of pops a lot. I like it. And I'm so excited to try this. And then let's see, where is the pattern card? Ooh. Oh, that's cool. Um, so here is the honeycomb cap. And I've actually made something very similar to this before. So I probably won't do this one, but I'll uh, definitely do the Charlotte. Oh yeah, that one's got some really cool um, lace work on it. So yeah, that's probably what I'll end up doing. And oh, I'm excited. So they do always include an extra as well. And so this is it. I'm not really sure what this is. Oh, it's a double pointed needle holder. So it's got like constellations on it and then you can just stick your double pointed needles in there and then it's got a little closure and everything. So yeah, that's nice. I do have some double pointed needles that um, they don't have a home. So yeah, they'll be going in here. Finally, there is a little card in here that I keep forgetting to talk about, but it's for butterfly boxes. And basically what it is is that you knit up a certain item and then you send it to this uh, butterfly box that will redistribute it to people in need. So this one is, uh, it says, the simplest of items can make a world of difference. This month, welcome a refugee with handmade washcloths. So you would make washcloths, you would send it to this address here in Portland, Oregon, and then they would redistribute it to refugees that need it. So I think that's really cool. It's a really cool way of giving back. And yeah, it's just, this is a really cool box. I love it so much. So anyway, um, that is my May box. And if you want to see more pictures of the hat from last month, I will have a link to my blog down below and yeah I'm, I'm so excited about this box I always love it so anyway yeah I will have other links below as well where you can get this box um, I think that there's a coupon code and all sorts of stuff so definitely check that out and I will see you in my next video bye